Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to the wonderful land of Vinland, where we are slowly learning about these things called Europeans. Some fucker down here with a weird ass flag. Look at this fucking shitty flag he has. He thinks he's a badass or something. And this silly religion. He says, Oh, Jesus died on the cross all these years ago, and now you have to worship this dude because this guy done diddly doodly. And like, fuck you, man. We're going to come down there and pillage you and eat your bitches. Now, at least that's what we're thinking. We may not say that to his face. Well, we might say it to his face. I don't know. Anyway, any good missions out there? Fortify Amino. Turn Maracaibo into a city. Let's do... No, we, won't, we don't have the money for Fortify Amino. All right, we'll turn Maracaibo into a city. Done. Good mission. Yay! Also, we are currently building an... Or not building an army. We're gathering uh, some, tr some transport ships to transport this army down to South America to go kill some natives because we have a mission for it. Not a mission for it. We have a claim on it. And claims are awesome. Conquer Portugal and rename them Poor Portugal. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right. We found Portugal's capital. And the poor bastard has one base tax in his capital. That's right. Port and center of trade, estuary bonus, blah blah blah. One base tax in the capital. He's also so weak that he's transferring trade to Castile. Yeah. Ooh, five base tax and four base tax. I like. Daddy likes. Yay, we cored Loot Fisk. Woohoo! Have we cored this one yet? Yes, we have. Alright. That's all of our cores then? It sure is. Okay. Are we done? We got four ships now? Nope. I need more ships. More ships! God, our naval force limit is massive. We can build 20 more ships. <laughs> we are so far under our force limit. It's crazy. Really? There's a province called Sauce? There's a province called Sauce. That's great. It's fucking great. It's called Sauce. Okay. Click on Castile's colony. You will be able to see their capital. No, you can't. No, you cannot. They have to finish it. They have to core it first. Watch what happens if I click on his shield. Portugal. They have to finish it and core it before you can actually uh, interact with them. So we can't even declare war on Castile, even though we can see his stuff. I can fabricate a claim on him. No, I can't. You can't do anything. He has to finish it first. Do not change the name of Sauce. Well, good news is we're exploring a lot of South America, even without our colonist, I mean, our explorer dude. Bad news is, I mean, if, if we had the, um, if we were able to use the hunt for El Dorado, this is exactly what the guy would have done. Except we'd have a ton of events happening at the same time. Ooh, four base tanks. Uh, we would probably have, uh, oh, f white Florida, cool. We'd probably have events like um, our dude gets lost, or he dies, or you found a city of gold, gained 300 ducats, or whatever. And there, there are some pretty good random events that can happen. All right, do we have our fourth ship yet? Tell me we have our fourth ship. Yes, excellent. On the boat you go. Shoop da whoop. Head down here, kill some natives, profit. The nice thing about this is it gives us one more province closer to forming our colonial nation. It's only a one base tax, but whatever. It's all good in the hood, G. Oh, what is this? Look at this. It's a new terrain type called Savannah. Nice. Unfortunately, it's tropical. Ugh. Tropical is harder to colonize. It gives you minus 10 settler chance. Oh, God, that sucks. That really sucks. Minus 10 settlers. God damn. That really sucks. All right, Tierra del Fuego. What do we got? Three base tax in Tierra del Fuego. Nice. Nine base tax over here in Kawasquar. Wow! I want it. I want it! I want it willingly! And Tush. <laughs> Tushy. <laughs> these names! God damn, these fucking colony, these colony names are terrible! <laughs> ah, trade ships are done. Okay, where do we need trade ships? We're probably good in the Caribbean for now. Caribbean's pretty solid. 
Maybe we should go back to Chesapeake. Hmm. Yeah, go to Chesapeake. It's fine. It's fine! Naval supplies in Maracaibo. All right. I can handle that. Can the AI do El Dorado missions or only the player? You know, that's a good question. I have no idea. Check Portugal's total war score cost. Okay. Total cost for Portugal is 141, which means he's fairly small. Why can't I do the random events? Because our capital is in a colonial region, so we cannot click this button to hunt for the seven cities. I don't know why, but you just can't. So we have to manually explore down here because we can't click that button. It's too bad. I love that button. It's so nice. Six base tax? Oh my god. The coast of Chile is so rich. Well, we're definitely going to get a colony down here. Holy crap, Chile is rich. Fleet has arrived at Longhouse. Cool. On the boat you go. Uh-oh, I heard that. <laughs> is that a rickroll? It's got to be a rickroll, isn't it? What could it be? I have to sign in. It keeps logging me out. Every five minutes, it logs me out. What is it? It's um, buttery bouncing breasts. He says, Shen, take this. Make the sauce. Make sure sauce is colonized and rename it to Shen's Secret Sauce. <laughs> we might be able to do that. Shen's Secret Sauce. To the coast. I like that even with three colonies going, we're still able to make a tiny bit of profit. That's nice. It's very nice. In fact, I'm going to up our maintenance a bit so that we can do combat a little better. And uh, what's our morale? Morale is at 1.6. That should be enough. He's only level 2 tech. Yeah, let's just go eat his face. One base tax. All right. Well, you can't all be winners, right? Nine, six, and then three. That's pretty good. But one, we'll probably still colonize it just to block off uh, this area. Probably. Can't guarantee it. All right. Kick some native butthole. Oh, yeah. They did. They did. Now, we don't have any siege pips on this guy. So we'll take out the cannon and a soldier and the rest of us. Can go home. If he had siege pips, then we'd keep him there. Because obviously he helps with siege then. But no. Oh, we have a fleet, though. We can probably blockade him with that transport fleet. Five transports. I wonder if that's enough to blockade. Probably not. It is. Five, five transports is enough to fleet blockade. Okay. Yeah, I'll take that. Come on. Come on. What do we got? What do we got? Come on. Ten base tax. What is it? One base tax. And another one base... Alright, well, you can't all be winners, right? Never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna run around and desert your... Ah, you were so close, Bellatros. So close. I think your sausage fingers have let you down. Is the music not playing? Or is it just very quiet music? I don't hear any music at all. It's gotta be just very quiet music, because it says it's playing a song called Canzoni La Bavara. Lots of one bass sax down here. Not impressed with this shit. Not impressed. Thank you, Prototype. Prototype has fixed Bellatros's typo. And we are now getting Rickrolled in chat. I appreciate. No, it's not random world. We don't have random we don't have random world and we don't have random countries, but we do have random base tax, which is why we're getting weird base tax all over the place. It's interesting and weird. And I'm not sure I like it. Like Portugal shouldn't be this weak. Portugal should be stronger than this. You know, 141% for all of his land is pretty low for Portugal. Six base tax. Holy crap. Well, is that all in the uh, Plata region? 
It sure as fuck is. So our, our Colonial Nation La Plata is going to be this one, this one, this one, and this one, and probably something else. That's like 35 base tax with just four provinces. That's pretty good. Wave of Obscurantism. Uh, I'll take the Prestige hit, because Prestige is perfect. It's pristine. Come on. Ah, good. He fell. Yay! You did. Goodbye. Yay! Court. Okay. I can't believe five transports was enough to full blockade that. That's pretty crazy. Anyway, pick up these troops, and we're going to go down here, and we're going to go eat the Apache. Six base tax. I'll take that. He's making 14 ducats off of it. Not half bad. Come on now. Keep on exploring. I should annex Portugal? Eh, we might do something like that. And Oh, wow. Six and then eight. The base tax is real. Holy crap, the base tax is real. And that's all La Plata. Wow. Because all this stuff over here is not very good. Like, three and four was the highest I saw. But on this side, we have nines, eights, sixes. We're going to colonize the west coast, definitely. Chile is where it's at. Use the economic map mode. Yeah, there you go. Look at that. Look how good the west coast is. Green and gold is where the, west, is where the, the base tax is. Eight, six, six, eight, six, nine. And on this coast, you have four, five, one, two, three, three, one, three. It's so different. It's like the West Coast. It, the West Coast in South America is just balls to the balls to the wall awesome, and the East Coast is like meh. What do we got in here? One and four. All right. Well, we found some of the Incans. Yay, Incans! All right, you guys are busy. You guys are. Oh, you made it. Good. On the boat you go. To Tejas. Tejas mas grandes. Si, senor. Si, senor. Ooh. Tejas mas grandes. Ooh. And exploring? Come on, show me the map. Show me the map. What do we got? Two and three. All right, less impressed with this area of Chile. This part of Chile, not that great. Central and Southern Chile, really nice. Hey, we're we're converting Toronto. It sounds like you have a lisp or something. Toronto. Ooh, gold. We found gold. 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 I like gold. What do we got? Two and seven. Ooh, seven base tax. Three and three. But seven, I saw that. Go on. Go on. It takes forever to walk through this shit. Come on. Come on. Two base tax, one base tax. Be glad I'm pagan. Why should I be glad I'm pagan? England's coming? Are they? Is England coming? Where? Where? Where's England? Don't don't scare me like that. Where's England? Ah, you're fucking with me, aren't you? You're fucking with me. Holy shit, Portugal's at 55 per year. Why? Land of opportunity and faster colonies. Alright, so he has land of opportunity. Exploration 4. And he also has expansion for oh wow okay so he's getting bonuses from expansion and exploration you son of a bitch portugal he's gonna have like 16 colonists isn't he <laughs> why can i walk through this fucker's lands i do not have access through Cusco, and yet i'm able to walk through his lands holy shit 10 base tax love it 10 and 6 with gold? Oh my god. Why can I walk through his land? I do not have access. You know, I'm able to walk here. I do not know. 
But we have our CBs, so uh, if we get a colony down there, we can fabricate all over him and eat his fucking face. Nom 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 gold. Nom 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 gold. One and two. Well, some of the base tax is nice, some of it not so nice. Yay, Balem is done! Woo! Alright, uh, let's see, you're still coring. Mod on how? Mm, I think I want to come down here and get this four and five to block off Portugal. Let's go ahead and get the five base tax because it's the important center of trade. And I think we can just walk over there. To Bahia! Oh no, the air falls ill. No! Inga! Inga! I don't have 60 ducats. Alright, Inga. You. <laughs> You got a 1 in 4 chance! Pull through, Inga! Oh! But, we do have Bothild, who's a 4-5-1. I'll take that. Oh, Inga, I'm so sad. I'm so sorry, Inga. We went from a 9-pip a, a air to a 10-pip air. So we actually got a little bit better on the air. I'm not so sad that she died. Besides, she's a fucking girl. Nobody wants to have an icky girl. Hmm. Wanka is a vassal. Castile has the Falklands? Really? No, they don't. We can't even see the Falklands. Don't give me that shit. Twitch chat. You're fucking with me. <laughs> yeah, Inga. Man up. <laughs> Nut up, Inga. All right, what do we got? What do we got? We got six base tax in Lima, important center of trade. All right, well, that's going to be a good target for us. Looks like he's a one province miner as well. I don't see any of his lands over here. Portugal's in Madeira. Of course they're in Madeira. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right. So this is so weird. With an explorer in the army, I mean, a, a, a conquistador, we don't need military access. We can just walk anywhere we fucking want. This is really awkward. I'm not sure what to think about that. But it does mean easy exploration. That's for damn sure. We don't have to send uh, diplomats back and forth to ask permission or anything. It's just automatic. Which is kind of cool. All right, are we there yet? Are we there yet? No, no, no. Pick him up. On the boat. Vamanos. Vamanos. I need more merchants, man. We fucking need merchants. Why can I not? Why can I not tech up yet? We're getting eight points a month. We still can't tech up. Because we keep spending our freaking admin points on cores. So I'm going to avoid wars for... Oh, ooh, eight base tax. I'm going to avoid wars for a while. Holy shit, 19 ducats per year from that province. Nice. I'm going to avoid wars for a while while we uh, tech up. Oh, seven base tax. Some nice land here. we got to try hard here. Four base tax? Ooh. Decent land, my friends. Decent land. And uh, we're back to losing money, but it's just, just, a, just a smidgen. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Ooh, tech up time. Now we're talking. What do we got? Training fields and a march. Very nice. We're tech eight, everybody. We are tech eight. And Portugal is tech eight. Hey, we're keeping up with Portugal. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid war. Don't give me that crap. I'm trying to be a good boy. It's just hard. Nine base stacks. I don't know if I can be nice to him. Look at that. We've circled the entire continent. I don't know if I can be nice to a, a guy who has nine... Well, he doesn't have that much base stacks. He's got 15 in his total. I guess we can go and X him. Nom nom nom. And now we can explore inland. Yay! We have a um, philosopher from Viagra. <laughs> Sir, we've recruited a new philosopher from Viagra. What? Well, um, have you heard about our lord and savior, the Blue Pill?
Oh, right, this is Wasteland. All right. There's two giant Wasteland chunks in the Amazon that you have to navigate around. I love the way the map keeps changing. Every time they do another DLC, the map changes so much. It's so... I don't know, it's good. So do I want to eat this guy? I, I, I really do, but we need to tech up. We need that, that third colonist. I have to stop annexing people. We need the third colonist. We need it. We gotta. We gotta third colonize. How's Castile's colony doing? He's almost done. Fuck. Portugal has finished Pernambuco, and he's going to Algoas. Alright, well, that gives me Sergipe as soon as we finish wherever the fuck this is, Maracaibo. Which is our mission, by the way. Hi -yi 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 -yi. Gosh darn it. Check out that base tax map. What do we got here? Seven and seven and six. Nice little trifecta there. Damn. I wonder where Castile's going to go. I bet he's going to the Caribbean. I bet from here he's going to hop to the Caribbean. 9.95. And he's done. He's done. He's done. Is he done? It's not done. 9.98. He didn't get lucky. He had a, 50, he had a coin flip whether he finished it and he didn't get lucky. Take that, Castile. All right, but now it's done. And now I can click on him and I can see his capital. There we go. What do we got, Castile? Six base tax in Toledo. Okay. I think it's normally like four or something. Explore more? Oh, yeah, that's right. We can explore. Woo! Good point. Thanks for pointing it out. Uh, let's Shit. take this douche bag. Douche nozzle. One, two, three. Oh, just put them all over there and then take the first three. There we go. You're going to go back to patrolling the Caribbean. Mm, yep. And then this guy is going to dock the hell up. And let's explore. Because we finished our colony in South America, which means we now have more exploring to do. Yeah. Come on. Explore. Do it. Do it before the explorer dies. Maracaibo is almost done. So where is Castile going? I need to check the colonization area. He's going right next door. Really? Okay. So it looks like Castile's focused on getting a colonial Colombia nation going. And I'm okay with that, because my colonial Colombia nation will be right next to him. We'll be friends until we kill each other. Yay! And we will be killing each other, trust me. Hello, Carib. Two base attacks. All right. Hello, Romanche Gop. Hopefully we'll be able to explore the Romanche Gop. I think we will. We should. I think. There we go. Lots more exploring to do. Show briefly the ideas or talk about that nation. Uh, I can post you the imgur of how we set up the nation. Here you go. Check that out. Yes, Wampanoag is on the list. It is. We will colonize Wampanoag. But I also need to make sure we compete with the Europeans. I don't want to I don't want to wind up second place, you know. Oh, look at this. Cape Verde approach. Cape Verde approach. Free hundred pop in Pada, very nice. And Maracaibo is thankfully done. Hello, Cape Verde. Can't see it yet. Okay, no more missions. Go to Caribbean. Maracaibo is done! Uh, that means we can go here. That'll give us a colony in Brazil. Yep, do it. Finished our mission. Next up is colonize Ayish. Again, I'll take it. I'll fucking take it. And you, you're not done yet. But you can head down there. That'll work. You'll be fine. And this will give us some border friction with Portugal. It's very unfortunate. But I think what we're going to do is ally Castile. Can we do that? We might be able to do that. 
I want to try to ally Castillo because that'll allow us to fight Portugal, at least defensively. If his colony attacks my colony, we can kick his ass. And I can rival... I don't want to rival Castile. I'd rival Portugal, but not Castile. You know what? I'll get relations up with Portugal as well. Just for shits and giggles. Improve relations with the Europeans. Good news is, all of this land over here is like garbage. Uh... Yeah, it's, it's economically very poor, which which means that when we colonize over here, our colonial Colombia will be stronger than Castile's colonial Colombia, which is mostly one two base tax. However, in Brazil, it's the other story, isn't it? Yeah, Brazil's just very very poor. There might be some good land inland, but the coast looks pretty poor. Whereas La Plata looks very rich, <laughs> very rich. Yay, we cord something. Oh, we can finally tack up. Woohoo! Exploration, go! Yeah. I'm sorry, expansion. Still focused admin, very good, very good, very... Oh, did I forget to hit this? I forgot to send him, whoops. I'm a dumbass. I'm a dumbass. The name is Dumas. Yeah, as soon as that colonist arrives in Ayish, we're just going to yank him out of there. He doesn't need to be there. We just want the 25 bonus settlers for five years. It's a really good bonus. Stop attacking me. Get over it. You can't kill my my awesome stacks. We're awesome, dude. Fucking awesome. Just stop fighting me, dude. It'll be fine. We'll get along just fine. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Vinland. We need a name for our Brazilian colonial nation, but don't give it just yet, because it's going to take a few years for us to finish it. Gosh, it takes so long to walk through the Amazon jungle. <laughs> and it's all considered tropical, yeah, so it takes a while to colonize. Long time to colonize. Go for La Plata? I want to go for La Plata, but... I also want to make sure we get our colonial nation on the best. We we want to get our colonial nation on the best lands in Brazil, right? And I need to go fabricate on this guy as soon as we're done. As soon as this colonist arrives, I want to fabricate on this guy. There we go. Okay, we now have a border with Portugal, so he hates us. That's fine. And we arrived in Ayish. Very good. Ayish, Ayish, Ayish. I made you out of clay with Ayish, Ayish, Ayish. With Ayish, I will play. Okay, and we're done there. Got our bonus. Bonus! Nobody's in the Caribbean yet, just us. Nobody's up here yet. All right, nobody's in Bermuda. All right. And... Let's see, four and three. Four and three and two and one, what up? And when I'm on the mic, suckers run, word. All right, let's start fabricating on this douche. This douche. You know what I should do is I should swap my uh, conquistador down there so we can go find that other guy and fabricate on him too. Conquistador, are you done? Are you done being a conquistador? Not quite. All right. But I can take the dude out because you've done your work for now. Whoops. Fighting. All right, take him out and just go stand in Para for now. I'll move him later. Uh, yeah. Go find these guys. I don't want you to actually stay there. Just find them and come back. Alright, fabricate. 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 Ooh, ah, ooh, oh, ooh, ah. A fabricate. Fabricate. Ooh, ah, ooh, oh, ooh, ah. A fabricate. Ba-dum, bum, bum. Fabricate. Fabricate. Ooh, ah, ooh, oh, ooh, ah. They have no allies either. That's perfect. Fabricate. Fabricate, ooh ah, ooh oh, ooh ah, a fabricate, fabricate, ooh ah, ooh oh, ooh ah, a fabricate. But um, bum bum. Let's go. Come on. Find all this shit. I want to find where the good base tax is in Brazil. There's got to be some, right? There's got to be some good base tax in Brazil. We'll find it. We'll find it. That's what she said. Well, we have our CBs to attack them, but I want to get our claims first before we actually declare war. 
that way it'll be uh, less cost on admin to core it. And that's important because we're currently doing an admin idea group. Turn Bahia into a city, improve relations, remove Portuguada from the map. Is this Portuguada? It is. All right, I guess I can take that mission. That'll give me a claim and I don't have to wait. That works. Remove Portuguada from the map. Yeah. But I need to transport some troopy whoopies down there. So why don't we pick you guys up? Why am I so obsessed with that music? I don't know. My brain just works that way. It just works. God. How does your brain work? Because my brain loves repetition. Uh, no, don't fabricate on Portugal. Uh, improve relations. That's fabricate. I keep going to fabricate. It's just automatic. Fabricate. Oh, you're going to talk to another nation. Fabricate. Also, looks like we have some rebels that might spawn. Otawa nationalists. 3% chance of Otawa nationalists. Probably not very likely. What about the Huron? 10% chance of the Huron. All right, let me go check out where's the Huron. Uh, is that this province? A little bit. Oh, it's there. All right, just increase the autonomy. I don't care. Yeah, just increase the autonomy. Uh, I don't want to pay it down. If they spawn, they spawn. I just hope they don't spawn. They shouldn't spawn, right? Right. What was that? Castile have set Vinland as their rival. No, Castile. Deal. Oh, man. Oh, the um, <laughs> the Iberian wedding has not happened. Okay. Oh, Castile, you little shitbag. He sent me as his rival. That motherfucker. Motherfucker. Castile. And Portugal has a regency. Well, that's fun. Still has the Avis dynasty. Are you married to Castile? Probably. Portugal will accept an alliance. I will probably take that. Oh my god. Castile has Valois dynasty. Are you kidding me? You're not kidding, are you? No, he has Vilena dynasty. He's married to France. He's allied to France. Why is Castile allied to France? What the fuck? That is not good. That is not good. Uh, not good. On the list of good to not good, that is not good. Wow. Not good. Oh yeah, we'll be allying Portugal. Don't don't you worry about that. We'll be doing that. Like, right away. That means our colonial nations can't fight for a long time. But uh, I'm okay with that if it means we have a little bit of protection against Castile. Just, just, just a teensy bit of protection against Castile. We cannot ask Portugal for this because we need to have a positive opinion of them. What? Well, why was I able to? Why was I able to ally the Native Americans when we have negative opinions of each other, but I can't ally Portugal when we have negative opinions of each other? What? What? Whatever. Just keep improving relations. I don't get it. I don't get it. How many troops does Castile have? Portugal has seven. Castile has. Um, 24. And Portugal still has 7. But yeah, Castile's got a big old honking army. But we're both Tech 8, and I've got mm, about 20, 22. No, I still don't hear the music. Did I turn the music off in the game? No, the music's on a little bit. But you know what? This episode's been going on for a little too long. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Come back next time where we're going to be attacking these silly little natives here before Portugal can do it. And the main reason to do that is to uh, keep Portugal out of the interior of Brazil. If I can colonize uh, Graujo, this shit, this shit, this shit, and annex these guys. Or maybe just get Oeiras, Timon, and Maranjao. If I can get those three, then I can try to block him off from the interior. The problem is, he's just going to skip down to this area. 
I mean, we'll, we'll do our best. Ooh, 76 executive prison. Prestige, and I don't need that. Fuck it. I'm not spending money on that shit. Are you kidding me? You're fucking out of your mind. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Have a good day.